say bribes? What does that mean? First thing is one bribe. What does that mean? Like, what, what's the message here? Like, it shows me that this is one of the milestones in my life, showing that, showing that I can like help another person see another day. Well, not just one, multiple. Like, is my goal. Okay. How old are you? Sorry, I'm 18. 18. 16. And are you guys from that neighborhood where this happened? I mean, no. I, I live, I'm located in the Genesee area, but I do. I live, I live. So you're a part of the neighborhood. You're, are you guys related? Yes. This is my cousin. Cousins. Yes, ma'am. And so you were at your uncle's house. You live there with your dad, with your mom. Okay. So can you maybe just share, um, if you can just provide, just a real quick recap of, you know, people are so excited about this, you know, they're calling you guys heroes, but you're saying, no, you just thought about people outside of yourself. Can you maybe talk about that? Like, I, I love the fact that people label me as a hero because it shows that, like, when people see me, they notice me, they're not afraid to, like, be themselves, they're not afraid to, like, be, like, oh, I'm going to be with him because they have that same feeling. So I just love, like, the positive energy everybody is giving me. I just love it. Okay, let's talk about today. This is, we're, we're catching you beforehand. So let's, how are you feeling? You know, you're about to get in there and get honored by the city. A lot of people are in there. I'm feeling nervous because it's a, it's a lot of big names in there. Uh, a lot of big programs that's looking forward to me and seeing my skills and, like, how I am. What about you? I feel good. I'm nervous a little bit because I'm, I'm like a lot of people looking at me when I talk or when I go on to get something, but I appreciate it. Can you maybe talk about what you think people should take from this? People are calling you two Samaritans, good Samaritans, you know? Uh, what's the message here? What do you think people should learn from this? Um, just like the church I go to, Zion Hill and Freeway. They always tell me, it starts, it starts with, in order to make the future better, it always starts with the younger ones. And me as a teenager and coming into a young man, I just want to show the youth, like, this is what we need to do, like, up, uplift our community, make the community feel safe. What about you? Uh, my motto is help others that need to be helped. Because you wouldn't want your family to be in that same predicament that that family was, to help others that need to be helped. And you guys said the family at first didn't even know there was a fire, right? They didn't even, they didn't even know. What did they say? Like, did they say, say thank you? What were the thoughts? You said, you said at first they thought you were breaking in or something? Or? Right, they thought we were trying to harm them. I was like, no, it's nothing like that. We're just trying to help you look, just smell, smell around the house first. But um, other than that, they just rained, they rained us with mad hugs. They gave us a lot of hugs. And all we could do was just hug them back, let them know it's going to be okay. Now, you guys went in that back office and talked to the mayor yes, and other people. What were they saying to you guys? And what are, yeah. your, what are your thoughts on that? It was like, that's a very great act. It was like, normal people wouldn't even be able to do that. So, the fact that they like noticing us for that, like, is, is good. Especially the fire chief. Like, that, was, that was nice. I like that. Now, here's a question for you. Do, what do you guys want to do when you grow up? I mean, you're 18, you're almost there. <laughs> One is being um, the officer said you should try a RPD, and then the firefighter, he was like, you should come with us, so it's, uh, I don't know. You're a hot commodity right now. Yeah. What about you? What do you want to do with this, you know? Same thing, but I really want to be a basketball player, so I'm going to pursue a life with big people. And I heard you guys rush to the building, so you got to slip this. You got that down. Right. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you, guys. Thank you.